What is going on guys, Etika from the Etika World Network here and when it comes to the Amiibo hunt, obviously there's a lot of people who are kind of distraught with the fact that you have to make pre-orders so early just to be able to get your hands on them and usually the pre-orders are gone within, I don't know, an hour or two. It's kind of bad and it was especially bad with Wave 4. I know a lot of people are still hurting from that. So we have news from my Nintendo News in regards to pre-orders being done from GameStop. My girlfriend actually works at GameStop so I'll be talking to her later on to see if this is confirmed but she was telling me that news like this could very well be happening but no actual solid concrete evidence yet. I want to give a shout out to Neru Yamni who showed me this and I think this will be great information for anybody watching who's curious as to what the hell the state of Amiibo pre-order affairs is going to be like in the future. I feel like this will be interesting for us both and once again this is my first time reading through this article so I'll be learning the information along with you guys so we can kind of come to the same conclusion together or maybe come to something different all you know either way let's see what this is going what's going on here so um, rumor GameStop may not take pre-orders on future Amiibo and there are a lot of people I'm sure are happy to hear this news but some people that may be a little bit distraught by it. Let's see more of the details before we make our conclusion. A Reddit user claims that GameStop may no longer take pre-orders on future Amiibo releases. Uh, Mega Man Ultra says that he had a word with the regional GameStop manager and talked to him at length about Amiibo and the pre-order situation. The manager claims to have said that they will no longer take reserves for pre-orders for future Amiibo. They will also limit the Amiibo sales to one per person. Damn. Okay. What happened to run... Oh, excuse me. <sighs> also happened to run into the GameStop regional manager as I went to grab Schultz, so this is the passage that, um, that Mega Man Ultra said. He mentioned that he has gotten word that they will no longer take reservations and pre-orders for future Amiibo, and all future Amiibo will reportedly be like the 29th, a sign in the window noting what they have and no pre-sales. Limits will be one of each figure per person. One of each figure per person. So not just one figure per person, but one of each figure. That's your limit. And to limit people using multiple accounts, they have apparently just updated their system to be able to track for multiple accounts using the same address. Looks like pre-order setups are definitely changing. Thanks to Master Pikachu 6. Dude, so right now, we kind of have a little bit of scary news for some, better news for others. The only problem that really makes this a little bit of a worry is the fact that Nintendo is not putting out enough supply to meet this demand, and that's the main focus right now. But GameStop is doing what they can to avoid customer dissatisfaction because, to be honest, man, there's a lot of unhappy people that are constantly going out to GameStops only to be told or to call in only to be told that their pre-order was either canceled or they never had a chance in the first place because they were done within minutes. It's a little bit sad to hear some of these stories, man, and I feel for a lot of those people. Maybe them doing away with the pre-order system is actually going to be good for everybody because now it'll be more about who can get to the GameStop first, which it technically always has been. It's just that pre-orders, you can do those online. But now you're going to have to actually physically be at the store to pick up the Amiibo for the next waves, perhaps. I don't know. I feel like my opinion on the whole thing, and you know, I have to clarify once more, considering I'm a bigger channel now, I don't mean to offend anyone with this opinion, but it's just the way I feel about the situation. I feel like this could be beneficial because there'll be there'll still be complaints because Nintendo isn't supplying enough people, and I feel like that's the main problem. But you know, we obviously are going to focus our you know anger towards different facets. We're going to be looking at GameStop like how the fuck are you managing this so horribly? But at the end of the day, here they're doing what they can to make everybody as happy as possible. And it's a little bit messed up sometimes that somebody who comes into the store hoping that they'll be able to get a shot at some kind of amiibo waking up early as hell only to find out that, you know, hey, you know, they're all, they're all gone, man. Seconds, that's it. So, I don't know, man. Online, and, and which pre-orders are they going to be canceling? Because I know you can also go into GameStop yourself way before the wave comes out in actual physical form and pre-order it while you're at the GameStop. Will this be no longer pre-ordering in terms of, like, actually going to GameStop or just, or just you know, no, no more pre-ordering pre -ordering in general. Uh, I don't know. I really don't know. We definitely need more details, but I'll see if I can squeeze any information out of my girlfriend in terms of GameStop handling future Amiibo pre-orders, and I will let you guys know if anything concrete is done or if any new practices are taken on to make things different when it comes to these Amiibo, man. I definitely want to be informed as well, too, because I have a lot of Amiibo now, and I definitely want to stay on top of the hunt. I still didn't get Jigglypuff or Greninja, but I do have Shulk now, and a couple of other great guys as well, too. Wario, too. So, I mean, hey. I'm trying to be in on this as much as some other people are, so I'll keep you guys informed on any further information in the future, as I do have an inside source. I'll talk to you in the next video. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.